just a little video here, a very short one. I went to um, another Home Depot store. Also stopped by Harbor Freight <clears throat> and looking for inner tubes. And there is no way I'm going to get into inner tubes uh, locally that are offset with offset stems on them. <clears throat> now Bob N already gave me a link to uh, a pair of Korean made tubes and I may end up ordering that but I was trying to see if I can get something locally which I won't be able to do until next week anyways but I'm hunting around for them. Uh, let me show you a close-up look of the valve stem that are on the wheels now. Uh, tires flat of course you see how these stems are they're coming out at a 45 degree angle from the rim now of course this is a tubeless tire there is no inner tube in it but in order for me to put an inner tube in it you have to have an inner tube with the stem coming out at a 45 degree angle the tubes that Home Depot sells and Harbor Freight sells are straight stems, so they'd be coming straight up like this, which would mean I'd have to drill a hole here and put the stem. I'm not going to do that, you know. Um, I'm getting about 50% of the people saying use slime. The other 50% are saying no. It's a crapshoot. It's 50-50 chance of working anyways. If I have too much difficulty getting tubes, I may have to use the slime. That's all I can say about that. Now I can order them online. That was a chipmunk. I don't know if you spotted that. I can order them online uh, from that um, eBay seller that uh, Bob gave me the link to it looks like a good deal I think around 23 bucks with their shipping if I'm not mistaken uh, for two of them I may do that but I you know I really hate to order anything online because I like to be able to actually look at it and not just go by a photograph or a description but that's probably what I'll do uh, the slime is not exactly cheap. It's like nine bucks a can. Um, and if it don't work, I threw nine dollars away. Mm, boy, got some water in there. That's the board from the uh, UPS that I scrapped. Uh, Jeffrey uh, commented on that and he says he has one that um, was beeping, very annoying. Well, all you got to do is take a... I tried unsoldering it. You unsolder the, uh, um, the beeper. But <laughs> I can never unsolder stuff properly, even with the... I used a lot of solder wick and still couldn't get it out. So I just uh, stuck a screwdriver on that and, and, and got it right out. It came right out with just a little piece of it left. So you take out the beepers. Uh, that's what I do. When they get too irritating, you just cut them out. Another thing you can do, too, on, uh, on the beepers is to... Um, If you can get at it, and I couldn't get at it without taking the whole board out, and of course by that time I scrapped it, so it doesn't matter, is uh, on the top of the beeper there's a little hole. If you take some uh, glue and work it down in there, that will quiet it down to a point where you'll hardly hear it. Or just take a, a pair of uh, side cutters and just cut it in half and pull it out of there <clears throat> so um, anyways 
that's about all there is. That, that one is just for Jeffrey there because he uh, maybe didn't know that. I'm trying to answer the comments and I appreciate all the uh, information. Um, I got the core removal tools, okay, tool and the extra uh, cores and the caps because I may go the uh, slime, the green slime root uh, way, but uh, I'd like to put tubes in it, be more of a permanent thing, but I, as I showed you, you need the, um, the offset valve stem. You can't have it straight up and down. I went to Harbor Freight and I talked to them over there today and they only sell the straight stem and Home Depot uh, only carries the straight stem and I did not get a chance to go to Lowell's yet. When I go to Lowell's, I will um, check that, but I think they're going to be straight stem too. Um, <clears throat> Home Depot sells the complete tire and rim, of course, but I don't need that. Um, and I don't need the tires. The tires are basically pretty good. They just need to be uh, tubed up. So I could probably go with the green slime uh anyways and somebody said well who told you that the green slime is messy i've heard from many many different people about that and i also heard from my mechanic about that it is a real mess to work with if they have to get in there and put tubes in anyways but if i can't get the right tubes i'm going to probably order uh, the ones on ebay uh, which state that they are uh, Korean-made tubes and not Chinese, and they are offset stems. Now, how much of an offset, that I don't know. The question is, are they offset <clears throat> straight up and down, but maybe on the side of the tube a little bit, or are they actually on a 45-degree angle like this, so that it matches the direction and the hole that's in the rim now that I don't know because once I buy them uh, and my garage starts uh, working with them and everything else I'm not going to be able to return them they'll be handled and you know and everything else and so um, I have to be very careful on that there's a lot of videos on putting tubes in, but nobody mentions about offset uh, tubes, uh, valve stems, I should say. Nobody mentions that at all. So I'm just making this video just to kind of make that one point, and then we will end it until I do get the tubes, and we'll go from there. So that's about it for this video. Not much of one, but you're surprised. You probably thought I was going to flap your ears off today, huh? Nope. Sorry. I give you a break today. Thanks for watching. Take care, everybody. That's it. That's all she wrote.